Hi, Nelly Odessa here from NellyOdessa.com. So this video is completely on plan, but it was totally inspired, and I had to shoot this for you guys to share, um, to share something. So yesterday I came home and I saw an Amazon package and I ordered a ton of books from Amazon. So I knew it was a book. I immediately opened it because um, I'm expecting a ton of books uh, that I ordered. And I found this book inside. Strength, oh, here we go. Strength Finder 2.0 by Tom Rath. And I immediately thought to myself, like, did I order this book? I don't remember ordering it. And then I saw a note from my accountability partner from Portland, Oregon, Vicky Lyoshenko. And she sent it to me as a gift. And it was a regular Thursday, not my birthday or anything. Um, but she sent it to me as a gift. Now, earlier this week, um, we, in the conversation, now conversations, this, the topic of, um, what this book is about was brought up and she mentioned the book, but we've talked about a lot of different books and the fact that this specific one she felt that I really needed to read, that she not only recommended it to me, she bought it for me and sent it to my home. I felt a sense of curiosity, but also a sense of obligation. That you know what, I really have to not just put it on my bookshelf for another time, but I have to get started and I have to start and finish this book. I have to actually read it and see, you know, what is it about and um, why is it that Vicky felt like I have to read this. So I started it and it's absolutely brilliant. Now let me tell you a little bit about this book and a little bit about the concept and then I'm gonna share with you two or three specific things that I learned that were really, really eye-opening. And I felt that you, my dear readers and viewers and clients and friends, um, you really need to hear this wisdom now. So totally unprepared, I'm here in between um, client calls I had a little bit of time and I just sat down. I was like, I have to shoot this video right away. I have to share this with you guys. So this book is based on the idea that we've all probably heard that instead of working so hard to improve your weaknesses, instead take that, that energy and that time and attention and focus. And instead of trying to fix your weaknesses, focus on utilizing your strengths. So um, it's completely different than the way, you know, our culture operates because most people, you know, they do mention in the book that most people who have like jobs and work for companies, those companies are so focused on trying to fix people and trying to help people develop themselves and um, in other words, fix their weaknesses as opposed to utilizing their strengths and talents to the full capacity. This book at the end, first of all, is based on real scientific um, research, a ton of research. It's a no fluff book and it's very action oriented. And I'm, I'm a very action oriented girl and I'm a very action oriented coach because, um, you know, thinking about things and like what I call philosophizing when you talk about these big concepts of success but do nothing about it is really a waste of everyone's time. I hate philosophizing. Um, I like, you know, get down to business. I like to learn a couple of things but also to take action on them so I can actually see results. So at the end of this book, um, you get um, this unique access code to take a strength find your test and they will tell you based on this test um, you'll get um, a printout of your five core strengths and then for each one of those you'll get recommendations for 10 action steps you can take to utilize the strength for ultimate success in your life in your business um, for ultimate success basically and I, and I love that it's so action oriented so um, I will put a link um, below this video to this book if you want to get a copy. And if you are getting a copy, just make sure that you get the one that I linked to because it's going to be to a new copy. Do not get a used copy because this access code is valid only um, one time. So if you get a used copy and this access code has been opened, you would not be able to take the strength finder test. And that's what it's really all about. 
So I'll tell you a couple of things that I felt were really, really brilliant. Um, I'll start with one. I've, I'm up to page 29 so far. So I didn't finish the book. I just get it. Um, I, I'm, just, you know, I just got started today. I just got this yesterday. Um, but on page 29, there's a brilliant example, and I'm gonna start with that one, like a brilliant story. Okay, so a man dies. Before a man dies, let, let me back up for a second. This um, book, even though it's called Strength Finder, it's really about identifying your talents. Because a strength is a combination of talent times your investment of time and, and energy and attention to developing that talent. That's how you get a strength, by taking your core talents and investing in those and developing those, and then you have a strength. And when you're operating based on your strengths, that leads you to ultimate success. So let's start with the story. A man dies <laughs> and he goes to heaven and he meets um, St. Peter and he approaches him and figured, you know, he can ask any question he wants. St. Peter is smart. Let's ask a question. And he asks him, I was always into military history. Just love the topic. Can you tell me who, what, let me see what exactly he says. Who was the greatest general of all time? And St. Peter points to, um, you know, to a man and says, oh, that's simple. That man over there. And this guy that just went to heaven, he says, no, 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 no. You must be mistaken. I knew that guy when he was alive. He was just, you know, a guy in my town. He was just a regular laborer. There, there's no way he was the greatest general. I knew him. He was just an ordinary guy. And St. Peter says, he would have been the greatest general ever had he had been a general. And it just gave me goosebumps, that story of, just think about it for a moment, of how much potential we have for certain things. Like, who can we become? Who can we be in life if we only take that path? And so as opposed to working so hard to to try to develop things that are not working or go down somebody else's paths. Why not identify what our talents are and really bring them to life and really shine that why? Why not do that? Here's another um, story that when I read this, I knew, I knew I'm shooting this video for you guys, okay? It says this. For example, if you're born with the potential to build large biceps, but you do not exercise these muscles regularly, they will not develop. Makes sense, right? However, if you do work equally as hard as someone without much natural potential, you're likely to see much greater return. So I have, you know, clients and people who attend my seminars and events and, and you know, just, just friends and colleagues and conversation, people ask, you know, I am, they say to me, I'm working so hard on my like business or my fitness program. I am working so hard. I'm working long hours. I'm working so hard. I feel like I'm slaving away. And I am not seeing, I'm seeing some results, but I'm not seeing so much results. But here's this other girl, this other guy, and, you know, I am certain they're not working as hard as I am, but they're seeing more results and they're seeing results quicker. And that really, this, this example, I'm going to read this to you again, really clarifies this, that if you are born without the potential for large biceps and you do not exercise these muscles regularly, they will not develop. But if you do work equally as hard as someone without as much potential, as much natural potential, you're likely to see much greater return. So it's not about working hard and slaving away. It is about working smart. And this book really, you know, I, I know this concept, don't work so hard, work smart. I've been teaching some of the principles, but this, these principles really add to that of, what does it mean to work smart? It's to utilize your unique talents and focusing on them, developing them so they become strengths. That's what it, that's what it means to work smart. And that is how you really 
excel without, you know, driving yourself nuts. That's how you excel. It's really, I'm not, by the way, guys, looking down at my cell phone. I'm not texting. I am looking down on my book um, because I do, I underline, as you can see right here, I underline a bunch of things in my book. So I'm, I'm referencing my notes. But it really is, it really is brilliant. And I'm going to leave you with one final quote for, for this video. And it is that you cannot be anything you want to be. But you can be a lot more of who you already are. And so it's been really eye-opening, especially the examples that I shared with you. Um, been really inspiring. I'm really inspired and excited to take this test and to see the results and to see what I get. And if you've taken the Strength Finder test before, if you've read this book, or if you're getting this book, or if you have any thoughts or comments or questions about any anything I've shared in this video, please leave them below the video. I'd love to have a back and forth conversation about this topic. I think it's absolutely brilliant. And thank you so much, Vicky, for sending me the book. And I will be, um, I will continue reading. And We'll probably make more videos to uh, with my insights from this book and also we'll share um, some of my results from the test with you guys so let me know your thoughts or if you have any questions and I wish you all much success with all of your endeavors and for you to starting now to start building an extraordinary life for yourself Come on over to nelliodessa.com. If you're not yet on my email list, join my email list so I can send you more strategies, tips, and inspiration for achieving your goals, building an extraordinary life. And I will send you future videos that I make about this book and about my own, um, my own discoveries um, with taking the test and with reading. So thank you so much. Again, nelliodessa.com. I'll see you there. Bye. Love you. Bye.